Genesis 24 begins with Abraham's request that his servant, who is not named, swear an oath to find a wife for Isaac from among Abraham's relatives in Mesopotamia. The servant agrees and sets out on his journey with ten camels loaded with gifts. When the servant reaches the city of Nahar, he stops at a well outside the city gates. He prays to God for a sign to show him the woman who should be Isaac's wife. The sign he asks for is that the woman who offers him and his camel's water to drink will be the one chosen by God to be Isaac's wife. Rebekah, who is a relative of Abraham, appears at the well and offers the servant water and also offers to water his camels. The servant gives Rebekah the gifts he brought with him and asks to meet her family. Rebekah's brother Laban welcomes the servant and invites him to stay with their family. The servant tells Rebekah's family the reason for his journey and asks for her hand in marriage for Isaac. Rebekah's family agrees, and the servant gives them more gifts. The next day, the servant asks to take Rebekah and return to Isaac. Rebekah's family gives their blessing, and she sets out on the journey with the servant and his men. When they arrive back at Abraham's camp, Isaac is waiting for them. He and Rebekah are married, and the chapter ends with a description of their relationship. What's the main point? Genesis 24 emphasizes the importance of finding a spouse who shares the same faith and values and shows God's faithfulness to Abraham's family. The chapter also demonstrates the importance of prayer and seeking God's guidance in making important decisions. What can we learn from this chapter? The importance of having faith in God's plan for our life is demonstrated by the narrative of Abraham sending his servant to locate a wife for Isaac. The story's circumstances demonstrate that Abraham and his family's faith in God's provision of a suitable wife for Isaac was well-founded. The necessity of prayer and seeking God's help when making crucial decisions is also emphasized in the story. God granted the servant's request when he sent Rebekah to the well in response to his prayer for a sign to identify the woman who would be Isaac's wife. This demonstrates the importance of seeking God's guidance and direction before making decisions. The necessity of selecting a spouse who shares your beliefs and values is emphasized in this chapter. Abraham was anxious for Isaac to wed a member of his own family who would uphold his beliefs and morals rather than a member of the Canaanite community. This emphasizes how crucial it is to find a spouse who shares our values and ideas and how doing so can lead to a successful and satisfying relationship. The story also demonstrates God's faithfulness to Abraham's family. By giving Isaac a suitable wife, God fulfilled his promise to bless Abraham's household, proving his faithfulness and ability to keep his word. Let us pray. Dear God, Thank you for the example of Abraham and his family in seeking your guidance and following your plan. Help us to trust in your faithfulness and seek your direction in our own lives. Guide us in making important decisions and lead us to those who share our values and beliefs. May our relationships be blessed by your hand, and may we always look to you for wisdom and guidance. Amen. Thanks for joining us today. For daily inspiration on God's Word, please like and follow our Facebook page and YouTube channel. The links are in the description. Please also visit www.wisdombegun.com genesis for more thought-provoking discussions on the book of Genesis plus free downloads and presentations about the Genesis story, ideal for use at Bible study groups or Sunday school lessons. Please support our channel by liking this video and subscribing. Thanks. Wisdom begun. God's words delivered daily.